Hello Virgo, welcome to your bonus love reading. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus, let's see what messages will show up for you today. Virgo, this is a collective love message for your sign. So please take it how it resonates and what resonates for your overall situation. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. Complicated masculine chaser. Mm -hmm. All right. So Virgo, we are connecting in this reading for you with someone I feel who really com complicated, complicated things. They brought confusion to the situation, illusion. I'm getting very strong masculine energy. So you might be dealing with divine masculine or you might be divine masculine, but I feel that this masculine really complicated things and this is someone here who was chasing you at the beginning and then they were expecting you to chase them i feel that at the moment things are not particularly great between the two of you but things will change as a mutual energy there will be energy shift okay or it's already happening when it comes to this connection when it comes to your energy um, Virgo, I feel that you've been very kind, considerate, attentive, very thoughtful when it comes to this person. There is this energy of being very supportive, very caring, very nurturing. But um, I feel that at the moment you might feel like this person played you. This is someone who's been wearing a mask. They've created a drama. They were over the top. There is something here about a certain situation where this person, um, it's like now when you think about this, I'm getting very strongly that they were looking for a reason to have some sort of argument or disagreement with you in order to have um, an excuse to do something else. That's what I am getting very, very strongly here when it comes to this person. It's like I feel that you are seeing this person. The main thing here is that they are over the top and there is something here about them masking their true emotions. I feel that you see this person as someone who hasn't been fully transparent. They were very sneaky and um, they really betrayed your trust. When it comes to this person... Uh, you might you might have found out that this person is in a new relationship or it's like they came they kind of um, presented themselves as someone who moved on very quickly or it, there is something here about the rebound okay that's or you might felt for instance for some of you it might be a case that you you felt or you're feeling that you you've been a rebound for this person or something like this you know excuse my broken english but either way it might be a case that you found out that this person is in a new relationship or, or they are dating someone new which gives you an impression that they've moved really really quickly or you yourself are feeling that because of what happened between the two of you you were just a rebound or something like this or you know what i mean yeah that connection felt like that well let's see let's see virgo as you were put in that position that's what i meant okay let's see could you please show me this person's energy and feelings towards virgo and this connection please I'm getting someone who wanted something from you, Virgo. And you felt like when they got it, they got, they've changed completely or their attitudes changed drastically. Hmm. Six of Wands, Ace of Cups, Three of Wands, uh huh, Three of Swords, the Hermit, 
and six of swords for some of you there might be physical distance between the two of you chariot four of cups oh my gosh and king of pentacles okay first thing virgo if 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 the case is here that this person is in a new relationship or you know that they started dating someone else that didn't work out i'm getting that this person might be putting on a face in a sense of um they might be still posting if for instance both of you have social media or something like this they might be still posting photos with this person or posting some sort of kind of you know um post right um about how you know everything is fantastic this is a facade because three of swords suggests that something here didn't work out and as much as it is about your situation with this person it is also about this connection that this person um kind of while they were with you they directed their focus on okay whatever the case might be wherever this person is with whomever they might be that didn't work out this is someone with the four of cups here who is not happy something here is not working for them and they are very nostalgic this person has regrets but you are dealing here with someone with the six of wands who loves attention and it feels like they are looking for a validation through this attention they love attention ace of cups <laughs> here is the thing virgo and we have your energy here so this person is focused on you they are thinking a lot about you okay this person wants to come forward here with an offer of love and peace ace of cups three of pentac three excuse me three of wands they've been thinking a lot what happened between the two of you this is also a card of expansion and growth or like we seeing that goal of ours we know that it's there but we are choosing subconsciously to wait in order to take action in the right moment because this person is holding the ace of what which is action so you have someone here who is thinking of taking action coming forward with an offer of love um, in order to heal this situation this broken heart this breakup this sadness that they've caused because actually i'm getting that this is someone who's receiving their karma the hermit here this is also your energy virgo you might be dealing with another virgo but that hermit here indicates that this person is very lonely they you know they might have many friends they might be again posting certain things um they might be presenting their life as it's as as it's as it's as it is great but this person is lonely they are lonely and they are missing you and they are thinking about you six of swords indicates here that this person wants to move forward towards the future with you and leaving this whole situation in the past overall energy for this person's part of the reading we have the chariot this is a cancerian energy so you might be dealing with cancer of course as a as a, as a sign of zodiac um the chariot four of cups king of pentacles yeah this is someone who wants to take action this is very action orientated card this person wants to chase you because they are unhappy with what's going on and king of pentacles suggests here that nothing it's 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 happening this is someone who feels very very bored it's like they are bored kind of energy i'm getting eight of pentacles there might be someone connected with your work related ma mm, excuse me matters or if that's not the case this person wants to work with you they want to put an effort at least they want to be seen that way well let's see could you please show me virgo's energy and feelings towards this person and this connection please we have the chariot we 
we have the world for some of you there might be indeed physical distance between the two of you ten of swords two of wands seven of cups and ten of wands well based on your energy let's see the emperor five of swords and ten of pentacles so you might be dealing with um, aquarius taurus scorpio leo we also have aries energy we have this divine masculine over here yeah uh, so you might be divine masculine or you're dealing with divine masculine but i feel that that emperor here it's showing up in the five of swords energy hmm. we'll, we'll get back to this when it comes to your outlook your feelings uh, towards this person this connection energy s the chariot with the world and the ten of swords uh, i feel that at the moment you might feel i am done with this this is someone who betrayed my trust um they became very very hard work they created so much confusion with the seven of cups they made you they made me feel that i am an option or the priority they prioritize here something else over this connection and i've been waiting for quite some time with the two of two of wands that things might have changed but they haven't and i feel this is your stand here virgo i'm getting that you might be frustrated and it's like there is this kind of energy of things has things haven't been handled in the right way by this person i deserve justice fairness truth explanation ten of one suggests that yeah this whole situation started to at some point it felt like a burden this person is a hard work and i feel that you know you are exhausted because of the confusion illusions you know i feel that at some point this person tried to sell you some sort of or at least it felt like this some sort of false sense of reality you know cross watches the rose can be reverse the emperor five of swords and ten of pentacles yeah i feel that you know for some of you, you felt like this emperor really played you in a sense they were very manipulative and they were playing mind games regarding a serious level of commitment regarding the long-term relationship the idea of this i feel you are quite frustrated with what happened between the two of you because you've been nothing than very nice and kind towards this person and it's like this person took your kindness for weakness well let's see let's see virgo let's see Virgo, if I haven't mentioned your personal sign of Zodiac, but you resonate with this reading, that's your message. Let's see. Show me the outcome. Three of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. King of Cups. Two of Pentacles. The star is a mutual energy. King of Wands. Nine of Pentacles. And Nine of Wands. Mm overall energy ten of wands eight of pentacles and the tower yes something here happened between the two of you you might be dealing with um aries a scorpio we have also aquarius so this person is coming to this outcome with the energy of three of pentacles king of cups and two of pentacles <laughs> it feels here that this person is going to reach out to you they will be very 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 charming with the king of cups 
they will be talking a lot about emotions, that they still have love for you, that they want to work with you, like work on the situation with you, with the three of pentacles, mm -hmm. two of pentacles. It feels like, you know, they will present you with the choice, essentially. It's like, do you want to be with me? Do you want to reconnect? That kind of energy I'm getting. What are you going to choose? The star here as a mutual energy suggests that this connection can be healed. Okay. It depends on you, essentially, Virgo. And we have a free final cards and also your energy that you're coming into this outcome, which is very interesting. We have a King of Wands, Nine of Pentacles and Nine of Wands. I feel that um, that's, I'm getting very strong energy from this King of Wands. It's like, I know, I'm getting this is your energy and it's like, I know exactly what I want. I know that I am a catch. I'm not going to settle for less than I deserve. And with the Nine of Wands, I feel that you don't trust this person. You are very, very guarded. And at this, this is what they're showing me. I feel that at this time, you would rather be single than, than be in a toxic relationship. I feel that you are choosing yourself. It's very empower. This is a very empowering energy. So what I am getting here is that I'm not seeing you being very enthusiastic about the, you know, about the prospect of them coming back and that reconnecting with them, with this person. I feel that uh, if that's what's going to happen and if this person is going to approach you and this is what they kind of planning to do, I feel that um, you are not going to welcome this person back with an open arms. No, I'm seeing you kind of, you know, expressing certain things to this person and uh, choosing maybe for this very moment to be single. And I feel your Ten of Pentacles with the Eight of Pentacles in the Tower is that someone here didn't put enough work in order for this connection to gain more stability. And at the very beginning, something here was built in a very flimsy foundations represented by the tower. And it didn't have a chance to blossom because enough work with the Eight of Pentacles wasn't put in order to create the Ten of Pentacles, solid, long-term, stable relationship. And I feel this is because of this person's attitude. That's why you might feel like, you know, a little bit frustrated and you might be choosing at least, you know, for now yourself i feel this person will have to do enormous amount of work in they would have to really change the attitude they will really have to put an effort and prove it to you that they care that things will be different not just some sort of kind of you know words and coming back here offering you something and then putting you in a position to choose and you know i feel that you are not interested in this you are interested here in action rather than words. And that's that's the bottom line. So for now, of course, the energy is fluid. It can change any time. I feel that for a lot of you, you are choosing yourself and focusing on yourself. Mm -hmm. And of course, you know, Virgo, if you want reconciliation with this person, I can see it happening because this is exactly what they want. So you know, decision is yours. But as a collective, I feel that for a lot of you, uh, you will try to keep your distance. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like, I'm not quite sure about this. I need to think about this, but I'm not seeing you rushing into things at all because of what happened between the two of you. Virgo, I'll leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly, truly appreciate you. Virgo, have a fantastic and absolutely gorgeous day. And once again, thank you very much for being with me. I am sending you much, much love. Till next time, take care. Bye.